Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back. Welcome to If You're New. My name is Abria Perry and I'm so excited to be talking to y'all again today. So, this video is going to be about my haircut. I recently got a haircut about three-ish weeks ago now and I have absolutely been loving it. So I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about why I got my haircut, the benefits of getting your haircut. So obviously there are many benefits to getting a trim, but there are also benefits to getting a little bit over a trim depending on what your hair is going through and um, where I got my haircut done in case you guys are in the area and you are looking for a good natural salon so without further ado let's get into the video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and follow me on instagram so you never miss any of the hair posts you know i try to i try to post y'all i try i've been trying to you know work on my whole like aesthetic and pleasing type thing but let me tell you it's harder than it looks so shout out to all those bloggers who are consistent with like the bomb aesthetic like y'all have your whole instagram planned out i appreciate you i see i am going to start off with where i got my hair cut and then go into why i got my hair cut so i got my hair cut at the beautiful salon in atlanta georgia it is off ponce de leon um road i think or ponce de leon boulevard one if you if you're in atlanta you know ponce um so yes i got my hair cut at the beautiful salon by sierra she's absolutely amazing um i have been going to her for the last couple months now i go every couple weeks and get my hair steam treated and um like just a really good like um hydra like moisturizing deep conditioner and it has been doing wonders for me um it's really hard it's hard doing your hair on your own as a natural in general and it's even harder when you have like a crazy busy life or you're a college student um especially since like i share my space so i share my living space with other people um i don't necessarily always have the time to kind of just take over the bathroom for hours and do my hair or I just don't I don't have the time like the actual space to do it and I just don't have the time to do it so I decided to start going to her every two to three weeks at least once a month to try to break up my wash days um within my apartment so that I wasn't you know inconveniencing my roommates and I wasn't kind of inconveniencing myself because a whole wash day y'all that's a whole day that's a whole day that I could be doing other things studying or editing or I don't know like I could be doing other things um so yes I started going to her every couple weeks so that I could get my hair treated and just get it some TLC sometimes you just need some professional help and that's okay <laughs> like you know what I mean sometimes you just need some professional help you need an expert's opinion no matter how good you are at doing your hair or you know taking care of your skin or whatever sometimes you just you need to bring in the big guns you need it I needed to bring in the big guns y'all like my hair was going through it it was just like I'm about to hit my five year natural anniversary. this is actually my third haircut um within like those five years and it needed it like it really really just needed it it had gotten long and it was kind of just misshapen um it was long but it, it it didn't look that great because it didn't have any type of shape to it it was just a big ball so i went to sierra i was like sis we need to do something about this i need some help so, so i went to her for a couple weeks um just started to like revive it and kind of see how much needed to be cut and what kind of style will work would i get bangs would i get this would i get that i also had a little bit of heat damage in the front of my hair that still we have not completely chopped off um our main concern was just to get my hair even and give it some shape because one side of my hair always grows longer than the other side i know a lot of people had this issue you guys know exactly what i'm talking about so um our first you know main thing that we wanted to do was we wanted to revive my hair and kind of see where it was at so were we like extremely having some issues were we kind of in the middle like was it really not that bad so what we figured out was that 
my hair really was not super damaged or super there wasn't anything drastically wrong with it other than the fact that it had just grown out and your hair is not going to naturally grow into like a beautiful luscious shape you know what I mean it just kind of grows and you go from there so um, I went to it for a couple weeks got treatments um, we did a wash and go we did a twist out just played around with it um, and then for my birthday, I got my hair blown out. I always get my hair blown out once a year. Um, I did once a year and I did twice. Once a year and it's typically around my birthday. So around every February, I get my hair blown out. Because, um, you know, you want to be a fly or whatever. So when I blew my hair out, I was just like, you know what? Let's just chop it. <laughs> like, you blew it out, let's just chop it. You're going to trim it anyway and um yeah let's just chop it and then when i go back to being curly if you need to you know shape it a little bit more um i'm totally cool with that because it's hair and it's gonna grow back if you treat it well and you're nice to it it's gonna come back to you so i was not super duper attached um i've always been a firm believer in healthy hair over length so I don't care how long my hair is if it is not healthy and it doesn't look good and I can't do the things to it that I want to do to it then it's really not doing anything for me so um yes I got that haircut and I absolutely loved it I will um insert a picture here of the next time that I went and she did a flat twist it was absolutely gorgeous I had the best shrinkage oh my gosh y'all that is the best when your hair shrinks up and it's just like boing like it's just like you pull it and it snap back and like oh like that is the best you know your hair is healthy and it's moisturized and it's living its best life when you have that bomb shrinkage with the snap back like so i had that bomb shrinkage with the snap back y'all and i was like <sighs> I feel like myself again because my hair was just going through it when it was a little bit longer um it was not holding any type of like moisture like it did not matter how well I deep conditioned it it did you know when I knew that I needed a haircut when my bentonite clay masks were not getting my curls popping um I have a video on my channel on my bentonite clay mask this is my holy grail hair mask i use this mask even when i was transitioning and it used to have my transitioning hair like it used to help it pull itself together so when my bentonite clay mask were not mm, my hair was like no sis you thought i was like okay we didn't go off of any particular style or i didn't show her a picture and be like this is what i want um she just cut it and basically what she said to me was you need to be comfortable with the amount that I need to cut not the amount that you want me to cut um you're right you're a professional I came to you and whatever we have to do to get my hair back right let me know and I'm down and she did an absolutely amazing job she is great I highly suggest her if you're in the Atlanta area or any of the women um, when my hair is freshly washed like it is just so shiny and springy I personally like my hair to be bigger and kind of more fluffy um, a little bit less defined so that is why it is like a big kind of fro now but I love it it's like a cute heart shape which I think is really flattering um, for my face and I absolutely do not regret cutting great as I've been I get in my hair to certain points and growing it out sometimes it gets to a point where it is just like I am not listening to you anymore Abria like you don't own me you don't run me bring me to a salon and give me some help that's what my hair says to me it said boop <laughs> I was trying to do it it said boop sis <laughs> We don't know you anymore. Bring us to a salon. We need help. So I went to a salon and my hair has been thanking me ever since. So thank you to all the women in the beautiful Atlanta salon. Thank you to Sierra. You did an absolutely amazing job. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. Do not forget to comment, like this video, and subscribe to my channel so you never miss any of the fun. And also follow me on Instagram. Much love. Until next time.